Hello, and my name is Sakaria, and I take a survey about EU freedom, United Kingdom, and also uh, and it is about EU freedom. So I mean, I mean, yes, I'm just. Can you record me? Can you ask me the questions? Huh? These questions. Hello. Hi. What's your name? My name is Richard Morrison. And what's the European Union feature? The European Union is like an organization where countries put like they vote together mm -hmm. to decide the country or uh, they say Europe itself like what is going to decide for the future and what is best for the people. Yeah. And, and how much money does the UK contribute to the EU? And how much do you get to think? I will possibly think about a couple of millions, about, if I have to say, I would say 100 million. Do, 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 um, they say, leave campaign, they say 350 million per week. Mm. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's why they that's why they now claim it. They say we can build uh, every day a hospital 350 million. Wow. That's what you actually yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, What's the referendum held? The freedom? Yeah. Uh, the f so why I think about the freedom? No, the freedom. They held the freedom before it wasn't existed. Um, yeah. Uh, I think that, well, it depends on the people. If the people think that's the best way of, you know, how the country is going to do it, then I think, why not? But as you know, I'm not from the EU mm. that mm. much, so I would say hopefully it, help, it helps the country. No. In Jones and everything. Mm. What's the benefit do you think EU brings to the UK? Because you are the generation of these countries. Mm -hmm. you know? I mean, uh, it is influence if the EU leaves, and if the United Kingdom leaves to EU, mm -hmm. all these days it is influence the generation coming up. Well, I would say people won't be have that much freedom like they used to before because mm -hmm. they won't be to travel to UK that much. Mm -hmm. And also, people who live in other countries won't have that, you know won't be able to visit the families that much just for three months. You know. It will be like an American, it's going to be like American laws. So it's not, I think it's not going to be a good way of doing things. I think they should just stick to the EU and just, you know, you know just stay away from mm. them. And what do you believe the negatives of being in the EU? The negatives? Yeah. Mm. I don't think any negatives in the United States. For example, I give you a small, small example. For some, they said the Cliff campaign, there is a more mass immigration people, EU people coming here. Yeah. And that makes influence with the housing mm -hmm. and job is low, very wanted more mm -hmm. people they come here. They say that some other businesses, they take only the European who come in here. Yes. They don't take with the British people. How do you think about that? Well, I can understand that part of uh, being that you know, preoccupied because it's true that with more immigrants that means mm -hmm. less job for British people. Mm -hmm. uh, the housing will be less painful, like won't be that much benefits because mm -hmm. everyone's going to be getting and coming to have some difficulties. Mm -hmm. So I understand that part that British people want you know, to have their own you know, laws to restrict and limit people to come to this country. So I think. I understand that part, but I think it should still stick because people are, you know, there's more quality university in this country, and that's why I'm so proud of it. And I should, it should really stick on it. And there's always ways to improve things. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, when do you think EU was established? The EU, mm -hmm. United Kingdom, I think. The EU, the EU, European, European Union, yeah. yeah. Um, I would say in the 1990s, is that correct? Yeah, um, no, it's more like from 1950s. After all, 1950s, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. because 1990 yeah. was before in the United Kingdom it was joining. Hello. Hello. Yeah, what's your name? It's Teresa. And uh, Teresa, what's the European Union? The European Union is a group of countries that have got together to help each other out in times of crisis and uh, with imports and exports and stuff like that. Okay. And how much money? A lot of people that have issues with it. 
and the government have decided that they will ask the general public whether they want to be in or out. Okay. What the benefits do you think EU brings to the UK? Um, probably the benefits would be cheaper imports. Um, obviously we can export to a lot of countries. We get a lot of but immigrants, but other people, people from other countries that come in and do jobs that the Brits don't like doing. No. Okay, and what do you believe the negatives of being EU? Okay, and along that same line, all these people from different countries are coming in here and taking um, advantage of our benefit system and our NHS. And when do you think the EU was established? It's been going for mm, a good 30 years. All right. Uh, do you think Britain should be in or out? I am going to stand on the fence for the moment. Yeah. Is that okay? Yes. And what is the purpose of the EU? What is the purpose of yeah. it? The EU. Like I said, it's a group of countries working together for the benefit of everybody. Thank you very much. Hello. Hello. What's your name? Uh, my name is Maureen Butler. What is the European Union? Uh, the European Union is a bunch of countries that have got together to make trade agreements and other arrangements like currency um, so that they're working in cooperation rather than against each other. Okay. How much money does the UK contribute to the EU and uh, how much we get in return? I have absolutely no idea. I know they're more or less the same. Yeah. We probably get more back than we put in. Okay. Why is the referendum held? Why is the referendum held? Oh, yeah. um, to ask people if they want to stay in the EU or go out of the EU. And they're asking people because it's such an important question rather than deciding it in Parliament. Okay. What the benefits do you think EU brings to the UK? I think it brings huge benefits. I think it brings us the ability to move around Europe without boundaries. I think it bring, gives us the idea of working in other places. Um, we get lots of ideas and um, people from other countries, lots of skills, lots of um, money. And also I think it gives us protection because we're working as a group of countries rather than just one isolated country. Okay. What do you believe the negatives of being in the EU are? I think sometimes there are regulations that we could do without. Um, I think, um, I don't think the Euro is a very good um, project, to be honest. I don't think it's worked particularly well for Greece. I think that's a terrible thing that have happened to Greece, but there again, they were of their making, but hey -ho. They shouldn't have been allowed in the Euro to begin with. When do you think EU was established? When was it established? Yeah. I don't know when the EU was established, but I know when the last referendum was, which was um, on June the 5th in 1970 something or another. It was my um, 18th birthday, so it was my first voting <laughs> ever. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. It was in the 50s, wasn't it? 40s, 40s, 50s, originally. Yeah, I can't remember, yeah. 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 Mm. Uh, do you think Britain should be in or out? I think it should be in. I believe it should be in very, very strongly. I believe it should be in. I don't think this is the time to start being isolationist. And also, I hate all of that, um, what's it called, um, where you th you think insular, you know, you think, well, right, we want Britain for British people and we want only British people can come here and um, we'll keep you lot out, all of you people over there, we'll keep you out over there and we can manage on our own because we are fantastic. What is the European Union? A European Union is a club who are paying money and sharing their ideas. How much money does the UK contribute to the EU and how much do we get in return? I, I think there is that's is a tricky question, but Leave campaign they are claiming they be we pay in the EU three hundred and fifty million per week. But and remain campaign they say we don't pay that much, we pay less money for that. And we get ten billion um 
Yeah, in the EU. Why is the referendum being held? Uh, because uh, that was a political issue. They come up want us to get a um, vote, so that's why he wants he just gave to the people a referendum. What benefits do you think the EU brings to the UK? Uh, EU brings with a lot of things like uh, jobs, making more jobs, and also like a uh, rights or employment rights. What do you believe the negatives of being in the EU, EU are? Oh, uh, that's I mean it's a tricky question. So, but um, there's a they say to people there's a lot of no less democracy, and also they complain like uh, immigration. They say we can't control EU immigration. When do you think the EU was established? Uh, I think it was established after World War Two. Do you think Britain should be in or out? But, uh, don't think still I can. I don't know now how I can. Maybe I think it would be in. Uh, I'm not sure. If you don't vote and there's a problem, yeah. who will you complain to? You can complain if you don't vote because you already you didn't vote, so you don't. That's not your right to complain to anyone. And what's the purpose or aim of the EU? EU cooperation on helping each other. That's... Okay. What's your name? My name is Liam Harley. And Liam, what's the European Union? Uh, two. Six. What's the European Union? The European Union is uh, well, simply all the, con uh, all the countries within Europe yeah. that have agreed mm. to terms. Can't say probably. Or simply, it's, uh, it's like United Nations, yeah, but for Europe. Yeah, yeah, for Europe yeah, okay. How much do you, does the UK contribute to the EU, and uh, how much do you think? Do you think? I think it's the fire, the cost of being within the uh, European Union is seven million. Um, take uh, for example, as that they say now, for example, leave campaign they claim they say. EU British and EU um, employers they come here so the reason British people